hi guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here welcome my name is Piso and I'm really really glad that you're here today guys I just want to talk to you a little bit about just give you a quick information about um, the camera that we installed at our house in Liberia and how we came about doing that about six seven months ago we watched a video by um, Dima LIB and on her channel uh, she talked about a ring camera that um, she installed um, at her house and it was a solar ring camera um, the security camera that we um, ended up getting was not a ring camera it was another one which I'll give you um, some information about um, in a little bit but when my husband saw that video um, about the ring camera that D Maya and, and her husband had installed um, at their um, house, oh my goodness, he was like, ding, 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 ding. Um, that's what we're going to do, Piso. We're going to install security cameras in our yard. We need to. And so um, Dima had footage of um, her talking to her nephew from all the way here in the States um, through the security camera, um, through the ring camera that they had installed there. And then she showed footage of it covering, you know, the uh, perimeter of the yard and showing everything so they were able to see their yard in the day, in the night everything and also able to talk to someone call someone from the camera and yeah so we were like you know okay so my husband started doing some research and so um the camera that he did get um decided to get was a camera from amazon and i'm gonna link uh put in the information in the um description the um, camera that he got um and the name of it the brand and everything but it was a simple um very inexpensive um camera but you know pretty pretty you know pretty good and so he um, purchased three three or more cameras i believe to put in strategic places within the within our yard um in liberia and so um and also he purchased um solar panels to go with each of those cameras because you need the solar panel to um constantly fuel or to for that camera to be able to you know be charged to charge that camera on a continuous basis so um there were um a solar panel for each of the cameras so we went home um this last trip we did and he installed the cameras within the yard and so these cameras they were not any um they were not what do you say a secret um to anyone in the yard that they were, they were being installed in anything like that you know and so um we did and my husband was able to um test it out when we were there because he has the app on his phone and so he was because we do have internet so that um feed was able to come right away um to his phone and so we were able to test it out in liberia and i'll show you a little you know picture and stuff here when we tested it out but the real test would have been would be when we come back to the states and to see how it um all um would be working was was going to work and so um when we came back to the states um my husband was able to pull up that app and um well for the couple of days that we were in transit that camera um recorded how it works is that it record feeds periodically um and stores it and then send it okay and so and then um it also um records when there's motion you know in the in the vicinity it'll record that and it's a 360 degree camera so it moves you know and it's able to um, record in the areas surrounding it and so um we're you know we were able to get feed um you know while for the few days we were traveling we were to get those feed and so um continuously my husband's been able to get um footage from the camera and how it also works is that you need internet so we have home internet as you guys know i've done a couple of home um the home internet videos if you haven't seen the home internet video just um go to my channel and then look for my uh, home internet in Liberia videos. There's two of them, and you can see uh, information about that. So because we have um, home internet, um, 
in the house we're able to um the the feed is um being sent um from the camera to the app so that feed is coming all of the time and um we're able to see what's going on and you know what it's very important we didn't know how important it was until we actually get in the feed now it's very important for you to be able to um see for yourself what's going on in your yard not that you don't trust um the people or whoever is in your yard or that you don't or you suspect something's going on it doesn't have to be anything like that it's just that you have access to your yard at any time that you want okay and you don't have to depend on the account of um other people who are there and say oh yeah everything all right you know it, 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 yeah okay oh. you know stuff like that so <laughs> you're able to actually see you know what's going on anytime you want and so that that has um you know um been really really nice to to have that and if we have questions about something we're able to you know either call on the phone or call right from the camera you know and talk to somebody and um ask and get clarity on something that we see or get um clarification on you know what's one of the feeds that that came came to us so that's been really really nice what's also been nice is that we're able to see um our grandson you know uh, oliver and talk to him um uh, right from the camera you know and stuff you know we talked to him all the time before but it's been you know just a little added cuteness that we're able to um you know also talk to him in the yard as he's playing you know and stuff we're able to just um do that as well and um so that's it but it the camera might not be um the right thing for you if you have um your project is not complete yet if you're still um working on your house your your in construction and you don't have home internet i don't know how that's going to work because you do need um, um internet for you to get that feed continuously so if you your home is already done and you there are people there or what you know or you know um you just want to have access to your yard you have access to the you have internet in, at your house you're able then you're going to be able to get that feed how we do with the internet and i've also uh um um what you've seen with the home internet um videos is that um we're able to recharge that um internet from over here so that has continued so we're able to recharge the 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 home internet make sure that the internet is working so we can be able to to get that feed and stuff and that's worked great and um so that's about it guys um on the um home um, security um camera that we installed i think um didn't think that we really need need a one you might not need one you know it's it might not be for everybody but i think it's a it's an added asset for those of us that are over here um in the states or living abroad in europe asia wherever you're at abroad and you have a home back home or your property back home that you really want to have access to anytime you want that camera um being installed in the yard is really really nice for you to actually see what's going on in your yard <laughs> and so um that's what we've done and so guys i hope you're having a wonderful week um it's spring and it's really nice and warm i'm finally able to come outside my backyard where i'm at now um and do a recording and um you know just about a week and a half ago we had a six eight inches of snow that was gone like that and so now today it's like um what is it 77 almost 80 degrees here so it's very very nice and so um hope you guys had a nice easter easter was a few days ago and um yeah i hope you guys have a nice rest of your week and i will talk to you guys soon all right bye bye guys